So this to me means yeah. you guys all got out of your own way. Right? So this we had a really me. fun class here today. And to watch the enthusiasm, and you see a wall come tumbling down, you know that you've made huge strides with that artist. Joan Larson, a renowned pastel artist, says teaching is her passion. And she feels fortunate to be able to teach in this space, known as the collective. And a lot of people come in and they say that they want to be creative, they want to learn, they have wanted to learn how to paint. So the artists that teach here actually align all of their classes towards beginning artists. Andrea Staines opened the doors of the collective with the intention of the space becoming a creative hub for artists of all skill levels and experience. This area needed a place that was open and inviting to any caliber of artist to come and work and paint. The walls of the Qualicum Beach studio are decorated with local talent. The floors are covered with drawing tables and easels. This free-flowing space provides a venue for artists to display their latest masterpieces, teach, and also learn from fellow artists. Sometimes when you're working on your own, all alone, all the time, you just get a little bit bored, tired, kind of, and you need input, and artists need artists. We have fun, we have lots of laughs, we have music, we, we just uh, enjoy our painting together. Having somebody constantly available to critique your work, tell you what you're doing right, what you're doing wrong, uh, is invaluable. So when you can see something through something else, it's an invitation to go play there. The collective yeah, so brings the that time. creative community atmosphere to high school students as well. Joan and Andrea started the Academy this year, a program aimed at helping aspiring artists achieve their future ambitions. I've always wanted to start something with kids and a mentorship program. And when Andrea again loved the idea, I just thought it was absolutely fabulous because this is such a good location for something like that. We're getting kids uh, ready for continuing education in the arts. And portfolio preparation is a daunting procedure. So the school system the way it is doesn't really help the kids with that. So this is where the academy comes in. The Academy fills the gap by giving students extensive lessons in a variety of mediums of art and also teaching the business side of being an artist. I fundamentally believe in the community of artists and what Andrea has created here is a wonderful community. Andrea hopes to expand that community by seeing more artists teach lessons at the collective. For Go on Shaw TV, I'm Rayanne LaPlante.